Welcome to the Bondi Scrapper Channel. Uh, 2021, hey, hey, hope it's better than 2020. Uh, this thing here, dug it out of the garbage a few months back. There was two of them, it was part of a bigger unit. I believe it's from a, uh, either a dishwasher or possibly a fridge. I can't quite work it out, but what it does is it moves this blue liquid, and that might be a clue to us. Um, it moves the blue liquid in there and the clear tube goes up around there and then it comes out that end and uh, the way it works is that these little bits here or there it's either that bit or that bit but I think it's that bit has like a roller on it the roller is hard up against the outside body and it's just like a cam and so it pushes in against that traps the liquid behind in front of it and uh, pushes the liquid around and back out that side. So um, little electric motors for me are always a bit of a bonanza. So let's try and pull it apart. Uh, for me, they always have, try to work it where the middle of the camera is. There we are, they always have more, more in them than uh, what you expect. Uh, you'll note over here, just by the by, tomatoes from the garden that fell off before they were ripe and uh, I was trying to work out why they weren't going red and then I looked at the label on the tomato plant that I'd planted and it's a black tomato, which I've never had before. Well, I've never grown before. I think you pay an arm and a leg for them. Um, this thing has got these little, come back in again there, little plastic tabs here holding it together. So, Let's break them off because without stabbing it through our finger. Preferably without putting them all over the floor and then we'll pull that off, pull that off. So this bit here and this bit here are off the bin because they're all just plastic, um, plastic gears and a bit of grease and oh there's a bit of butt little little spring just there that's exciting i'm sure it's just mild steel not worth a thing but we'll put that into the re recycling part um that cover there plastic now this guy got some weight to it and coming up here oh. There's a little clip just there. So if we get the side cutters and just get under the clip, come on this side. There we go. Got him. And we got any more of those? Oh yeah, there's another one just there. And you could even cut that off rather than bend it out. We see, there we go, that comes off there. So that bit goes into the, uh, let's call that one the recycling bin. And I'm trying not to get grease all over me here. And then what do we do? Oh, okay, okay, we just, oh, did you see that? Oh, pull that out and look at that, there's our, um, there's our copper, and then what I usually try and do is, this plastic's usually pretty brittle, so I just kind of put the side cutter under the under the edge of it, and lever it like that, and it just kind of breaks off. Can't tell whether I'm in camera. Oh yeah, I'm in camera. That's unusual for me. What have I done? All the uh, interesting stuff gets done off camera. So those two there will probably be copper. So I'll have a look at that in a minute. Get the plastic off it. 
And then hopefully if I've got enough of the plastic off, you can just kind of pull that off. Well, no, I haven't. But anyway, we'll, we'll soldier on because, you know, it's showbiz, my troopers. Oh, and I'm so tempted, so tempted at the moment to do a quick rendition of Ethel, Ethel Merman, seeing there's no business like so, show business. Fingernail into it if you've got one. Get the last few bits off. Oops. That's on the floor. Get that later. So we got this beautiful fine hair copper which I throw in with. With, with, with windings copper. Um, put in a ball like that. Let's uh, weigh it up. So what did we end up with there? Well, that little nub of copper, which weighs, um, whoa, strange lights. Uh, 22 grams, not much, but um, bird copper like that is worth uh, $7.55 a kilo at the moment, Australian. Uh, 22 grams, that's going to give you 16 cents, almost 17 cents, and um, that's certainly got to be better than if you'd thrown in the whole electric motor into electric motors, and even and if you hadn't stripped it out, if you just left all the plastic casing, uh, they would have given you nothing, I would think. Or maybe, maybe shred, maybe, if you had it in with a bundle of big other stuff, but... Uh, so yeah, 17 cents there, that didn't take long, in fact this wind-up is uh, taking even longer. Uh, hey, let's all have a great 2021. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.